Hello and welcome to episode 12 of my Folktale tutorial Let's Play series. This episode will be on getting Sir Gregory to do his stuff in the mine because ten Kenny's time is nearly up and of course this is the quest that I've had for ages. But you can see you don't have to dive right into doing the questing side of uh, Folktale you can just have a bit of settler fun and build up your community which is what I strongly recommend check out this up here so in the last issue uh, episode the firewood was down to 200 or just above or just below now it's creeping up nicely and the planks whilst were first affected they're now pushing on strong so I can just keep crafting them into more planks uh, iron is gradually going up not a drastic need for me to deal with that carrots fish they're getting going in the right direction towards 1000 meat pies you can see have made a tremendous recovery now and are heading to 1000 the bread Our did, village is under attack the bread the bread did take a dip that was down to 700 so as all as i did was placed one more additional wheat field here and that seems to have recovered the bread so I'm not sure what was going on with that but just to be on the safe side I put in another Our field village here. Has attracted new settlers. I might have to put more workers into the windmills eventually if it happens again I'll keep my eye on it. Mead is staying at 500 what can I say so I'll keep that there okay right well what this episode is going to be about is actually doing this quest to confront Kenny and deal some swift justice so we click on Sir Gregory or we'll double click on him that will find him for us your orders oh yeah we select him and now we head to um, the quest location which is here I believe so let's walk onward him, walk him over you can see that little cog something's not right you men wait here in case more of Kenny's lackeys show up and outblink me I'll head in and open a can of whoop ass on these rascals well, someone seems to have beaten me to it they certainly do said Gregory okay so the enemy is in our village yeah when you see chests right click on them and then you can grab the loot that's inside and sometimes there's some very nice loot so always check the barrels and chests okay let's get Kenny into the mine you can't take your militia in there only your heroes so Sir Gregory and enter bandit caves so here's where the game takes on a completely RPG adventure side which is absolutely fantastic to complement the settler side of the game you should all be able to tell by now how special folktale is I mean the fact that you can adjust their statistics as they gain levels um, it's the best kind of RPG uh, you can go right down into keeping adjusting this making the heroes unique adjusting their armors and their resistances it's got all the good stuff in it this game okay let's get some more chests and then put Sir Gregory to work and you can get lots of upgrades for not only your city watch but also for Sir Gregory Tis an honor. So I expect we'll have to do some fighting in a minute. Mine is to obey. Glad to hear it. Oh, what's that? So if we want to check this, oh no he's got better boots on, so yeah no no upgrades for him yet but I could use them for the city watch. Let's see what's over here, nothing, 
Okay. Orders received. We can see on the map a little red dot denoting that there's going to be some fighting. So we're going to go fight these. Before we do, let's give him iron skin and then rush in. They shall not pass! Stun time. Check that out. So cool. You lay waste to them. Especially if I do that one. Look at that. Now that's what I'm talking about. So Gregory is cool. And of course, as he kills, his experience will go up and he will gain another level. See that? Bang. So we want to get ourselves a tough little Gregory. Get him up as many levels as we can. But the fun don't stop there because there's more heroes that we can acquire, as you're going to see. It just will get better and better. Okay, anything else? No, so we dealt with them. Double time! Let's continue into the mine. I have got potion slots, I just haven't given him any potions, um, because if he dies he'll come back to life, it's fine. When he dies he will lose a bit of experience, but not a great deal. fully healed. Right, cool. So look at this. And we get some nice loot. A wand. I wonder who that can be useful for. Well, we're going to find out eventually. But that's another episode. And it will be a good one. Okay, so let's now level up Sir Gregory. Um, I think I want to give him more strength because he does more damage. Course agility would give him better defense, vitality, better, more life. Uh, mind for casting these buffs and attacks. But I'm going to go for strength for now. I want him to be. See, the swords went up. Not by much, but. It, his attack did go up. So that's good enough. Right. Cool. So he's got more hit points now. 390. Cool. Okay, let's carry on. Making sure to loot everything as we go. Okay, so when you get to here, you're at a crossroads. You can either go to the left or to the right. And if I remember correctly, you should always go to the right first of all. And I'll show you why. Remember, once. remember it's the Q and E keys. We'll turn you your screen around. It's a little getting used to, but you'll get the gist. Oh, what's that? Hmm. Oh, there's a health potion. So, now if things get really bad, I can consume a health Quick potion. March. Okay, so we got more fighting to be doing. And there is a lot, a lot of the enemy. So what we'll do, shield him up, iron skin, and then rush in with our shield bash. Oh, I was a bit premature with that, but never mind. Ah, I just love that. Uh, Power slam, so cool. One down, two more to go. 
at least I didn't aggro them all. Oh, they're probably being dead. Oh, that was a close one for Sir Gregory. I don't want to waste that potion. There we go. Okay, we'll let him get some health back and then we'll deal with them wolves. Wait for the timers as well to go back on our skills. Right, there we go. Wolf time. By your leave. So, here we go, someone quicks is trapped in this cage. I don't know, sire. He seems rather dubious. Why is he all locked up like a criminal? Just because he's imprisoned in a sketchy cave doesn't necessarily mean that he's not a person of integrity. For shame, Sir Gregory. My apologies, my dear. I'm sure this strange-looking fellow has a perfectly legitimate reason for his incarceration. Yes. Tch. Simply perusing the contents of this cave. I do love the wording. <laughs> you don't seem to be human. What are you? Sorry, excuse me. I'm a Grublin. Grublin. I don't trust this thief, sire. He's clearly being evasive. So he was going to rob the bandits. Well, you know what? That's not such a bad thing. So that sounds good. So now we have an additional hero to control. How cool is that? And Quix is, you'll notice, up here now underneath our main hero, Sir Gregory. Remember, the difference between your heroes and the City Watch is when the City Watch dies, they're dead and gone and you have to create more. With Sir Gregory and Quicks, when they die, they will lose a little experience. Uh, they won't go down a level, but they'll just lose a little of their experience. And so you just... They'll respawn back at their points. You just send them in again, keep fighting, and they get the experience back. So the heroes are just unbelievably cool because you can just keep levelling them up. And that's what we're going to try and do. But we first need to deal what with... What would you have me do? We need to first deal with Kenny. Now, you can get different items for the different heroes, types of heroes you can get, you can collect. At the moment, you can see I've got a warrior and a thief. We will, of course, be getting a magician um, with spells. So, that's going to be cool. There's a shield. Cavalry, I notice, can use that. I'm not sure if they've had uh, cavalry been added yet, but we'll find out eventually. Now, is there any more crates? No, I think we've done it. So now we're going to go back to the crossroads and continue to the left. As you command. Which I 
believe was this way. Oh, there is the time. Wow, time's gone quickly. But at least I managed to liberate quicks before that happened. So, okay, I'll end it here. Uh, time has gone. In the next episode, our heroes will continue in this direction, onward to face Kenny. Uh, so he can stop terrorising our peasants and stealing from them. We're also going to have a load of treasure to loot and creatures to fight. Wherever you are in the world, God bless you and keep every single last one of you safe. Thank you for watching and have a fantastic day. Goodbye.